Master Tags is back. I am on a server by the name of Dragonstone. And yes, you've noticed I am probably wearing a different skin from last time. Well, when I first started doing this, I was trying to figure out exactly what skin I was going to use. And yeah, I right about behind me, there are uh, two of the members of the server. Dragon Master and Meto Cool. Yeah. Probably going to primarily be, most of the videos you're going to see is probably going to be, you know, on this server, stuff like that. And well, let's see what kind of, uh, antics we get up to. Wait. Oh, that was work. Alright! Time to get to it. And that was not the right... Alright, right now I am on board a base that I have been uh, working on for quite some time now. The Shooting Star. It's an airship. Stuff happened and it turns out I'm building a fleet. Uh, crazy stuff happens on this server. You know, we got ship over there. We got this ship over here, which actually I did not build. This was, uh, built by a kind of server friend of mine by the name of Tiny Penguin. Or as I call him, Tiny. Alright, I'm here with Tiny Penguin. <coughs> I'm recording this clip uh, after the fact of, uh, everything, mainly because he's now online. So yeah, this is Tiny Penguin, the second member of the fleet that actually has a ship. So far, he's pretty decent at on and he built this entire ship. And I will admit, it looks better than mine. <laughs> Even though it's smaller, it's much more detailed. Well, on with the show. Man, he is uh, pretty good. And Dragon Master still to me. Let's see. What is up to? to say anything? Well, this is uh, certainly interesting. <laughs> Riveting conversation. I think he's probably just typing something out pretty long. See ya. Oh, best yet. Yeah. Mm -mm. It works. <laughs> of course, the ship has weaponry. Actually, a kind of letter in there. No, not. Well, these are supposed to shoot chickens. But they're currently not armed right now. For some time I've been on the server, in fact, uh, just out there beyond render distance was my first base. You know, it was a pretty good starter. But I have uh, moved on to much more loftier positions. Do -do -ch. Actually, uh, yeah. Oh, I still have my uh, sub weapon from when I was working on. Oh yes, by the way, I was working on a kind of a large project in the server so far. A large capture the flag arena, which as expected, is taking forever. You know, I just mean... Look at this! This thing is huge! This is the platform that the arena is going to be built on. I'm about a third of the way done. Well, between a third and a half, I think. But I still have a long way to go, and a bunch of cobblestone. Uh, it's actually, I'm not sure who that bunch is. I'm probably going to keep that as part of the uh, arena, to be honest. Why? Because it's just kind of odd. That, and I didn't place it there. One of the worst part is, it takes a lot of time to get here from the ship, in a way. It's already night. 
Well, I guess it's time to go do a bit of mining. And the door didn't activate again. Man, this is weird. Oh no, Darlick down. Grab some torches. Now I guess it's off to the mine. Oh yeah. Before I go, yes, I have an absurd amount of chickens. Alright. If you say so or put that down in the comments, yeah, I'm <laughs> not the first one to say that. It has been said a lot by the other serve mates. <laughs> Alright. Time for a leap of faith. Any pools. They're great. <laughs> Couple of boneheads. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> that didn't work. <laughs> Uh, so I should have started making videos earlier. The server had a pretty interesting uh, Halloween event going on, where there was these special kinds of uh, skeletons that were spawning. Scary skeletons, in a way. Three kinds. The spooky, the very spooky, and the spookiest. I, I don't know why, but at some point they, called, they started calling the spookiest skeletons Skilla bosses. Don't know why. I just did. <laughs> What's up, the server? It's a blast. The people are uh, a bit crazy and a bit weird, but they're genuinely pretty nice. I have definitely uh, found a uh, pretty good group of uh, fellow server members. Where is that hole? I came down here earlier to do some mining, and well, I found a lot. <laughs> uh, right here. Wait, was it? I think. It... Yeah, it was. I think. Yes, it was. Let's get to it. I don't know why. When people when people strip mine, they just dig in a straight direction. I dig in a straight direction. In a uh, very interesting way. I just find it, I seem to find a little bit more ore that way. Also, while mining down here, I usually have uh, my torches in my offhand. Guess I don't have this one bit. And I swapped it with. Come on. There we go. I wonder what the next event on this server is going to be. It's probably definitely going to be an interesting one, though. I should start making arrows. Well, I don't need, you know, really that many arrows. Well, because my uh, bow has infinity on it. But, you know, I seem to end up with uh, a lot of uh, flint a lot.
that doesn't have any gravel, I guess. Actually, is there a cave up there? Nope. Well, there is more coal, though. Oh, I have so much plans to do on this server. A lot of them are big projects. Such as creating a dungeon. Why? Because, well, I am just generally good at making dungeons. Endl endless labyrinths. Well, near endless anyway. Where's the fun if it, there is no end to a labyrinth? But, you know, long labyrinths, multiple levels, traps, making it dark enough where bombs typically spawn almost at any time. Ah, oh, it's going to be a blast. I should definitely put a sign at the beginning of it once I do inevitably build this thing saying, Warning! You may lose your stuff. <laughs> and almost. You know, put up a sign, you know, saying, Do not blame me if you lose your stuff. You have been warned, kind of thing. Ooh. Beautiful green gems. No teal ones. I'm feeling though I could run into them any time. This mine is down at good old y equals thirteen. No, oh, eleven. Yeah, close enough. <laughs> and yes, before you know, you start going blowing it up in the comments. Yes. I know that white, I know that diamond level is the level 11. It just sometimes my brain can be, it gets it wrong, it puts it at 13. It's within a two number uh, margin of error. Which I always say, it's a pretty good way to go about things. Ah, uh, redstone. I could always need more of that to fill up my shop. Oh, yes, right. I have a shop. Upon this, on the server that I have named Redstoners. It's just kind of a little thing. Good idea to make a little bit of extra diamonds. And, you know, sometimes crafting up all those redstone resources is uh, kind of a bit tedious. <coughs> but you also might say... Alright, is it also tedious for you? The answer is yes. Yes, it is. But, hey, who cares? It's kind of, it's fun to do. Well, so, so it seems like most everyone else has, you know, a shop on the server. And, you know, I had a absolute royal ton of redstone resources. Why? Because I keep finding the stuff. So, why not make a bit of a profit off of it? See, like right there. More redstone. Times uh, being down here all the t a lot. Reminds me of that, uh, one song on, uh, on YouTube, uh, Diggy Diggy Hole. In fact, there is actually a few people with their username has something to do with dwarves. Actually, are any of the dwarves online? No. No, they're not. No. Boo. See? Even more redstone. You just start collecting a lot of this stuff. 
especially when you uh, <laughs> have uh, kind of a pickaxe like mine. You know, so this server is a primarily vanilla server. It's got a few, you know, extra bells, of bells and whistles. But, you know, they're genuinely pretty good. Then again, I've only been on here for a little extra, extra time, you know. It's got a PvP arena that is accessible from spawn, which was you know, not the town we were in earlier. That place has been, was known as Noob Town. It, I don't know how it got its name, but in jest, it is uh, a starter location. I guess, you know, Noob more or less of instead of Noob player, of uh, more towards a uh, new member of the server kind of thing. That version of Noob. In fact, uh, one of the places that runs Noob Town was Dragon Master, that who uh, we saw earlier. He's a pretty good run. He is one of the co-mayors of Noob Town. Him and uh, XM Awesome Sauce. They normally keep to themselves. I wonder if any of the others of members of uh, the fleet will pop on. That would be nice. Yeah, show, you know, have a bit of their internet debut. <laughs> you know, I guess if they want. a beacon. Oh, well, actually, before I actually make myself a beacon, I need to <laughs> make myself some nether exploration armor. Fireproofing, you know, stuff like that. That's because every time I go down into the nether, I seem to be somehow aggro, the, I seem to somehow aggro the pigmen. I don't know how. Last time it happened, I didn't even hit them. It's just like, they saw me, they were aggroed, and next thing you know, I was pork lunch. And all I was down there was to try to get some gas tea. There's the one resource that I always have trouble finding on other servers seems to be slimes. You know, occasionally I'll spot a, a slime or two, but they always seem very rare. I don't know why. You guys probably couldn't hear it, but, uh, <laughs> spookiness I thought was supposed to stop yesterday. Maybe because, well, now it is, uh, it's, you know, November 1st. Halloween, and Halloween is over, unfortunately. It's always such a funny, fun time of the year. You know, I even had a Halloween skin. Instead of, you know, the version you currently see now, I was, uh, I guess you can say a, a bit thirstier version. A vampiric version. <laughs> Falling into holes. That's also seem another thing I seem to be good at. more go forward. Come on, Mike. Get 
Give me something teal. And the answer to that is... Um, it's trying to look like it's probably going to be a no. Unless it, you know, it's hiding in the cold. Which could be a possibility. Whoa, mining for 16 minutes? Actually, then again, you know, that's completely possible with me. Uh, when I go mining, I go mining. As you can almost say, I'm a dwarf at heart. Teleportation, go! Oh, nice! The pressure plate decided to work! For once. And uh, craft these into blocks. Hmm. Looks like three extra coal of those. So, yep. All right, or redstone. Good solid number of blocks. Let's go throw these down into the redstone box real quick. Just go put these in the super smelter. No, okay, it's not exactly a super smelter, I guess. More of an auto smelter. And put a large amount of iron. Or out comes a pretty good amount. I should probably throw those in my shop. That's cooking up. I'll go put the rest of the stuff in my uh, assortment of boxes. <laughs> hmm. Glad I spotted that. Kind of weird seeing that it happened while I was. Uh, <laughs> Recording! <laughs> uh, <coughs> and if you haven't been listening to me cough a lot, it is finally starting to get cold. Well, okay, I guess it has been kind of getting cold out where I live. And, uh, or I should say more, it's starting to get cold where I live enough to the point where it is messing with my vocal cords, and I might be starting to come down with a bit of a cold. Possibly. Almost. Huh, I wonder what happened there. Could have been a levels dispute. Eh, possibly not. Probably, probably not. Solid question. I look lost. I am a bit lost. I'm trying to figure out what to do next. Oh boy. 
Well, I almost guess this would be a pretty solid dig out the first episode on the server. Just showing up exactly what all things about. And just kind of introducing it. You should... Uh, you should join. Come join the server if you were new and... Not someone I know, because some of the subscribers are actually a few friends that I know in real life. But, if you're just finding this randomly on YouTube, or you found the channel and have joined up, come, join the server. It's free, you don't have to pay for anything. It's pretty nice. Until then, see ya, Master Tags, signing off.